I'd say it's probably one of the most difficult years in our 40 year history. With the lockdown that happened in the spring and the shutting of the bookstore completely for over two months. Financially, that was a huge blow. But we've pivoted on several fronts. I think some people would say switching to employee owned during the middle of a pandemic in 2020 is a risky move. We all think that it's a smart move and it's a move that's gonna guarantee our success into the future. As COVID sort of came about and the lockdowns happened and we had to lay off staff, it really came apparent that we need to not only take care of the business, but our staff. One idea was to make it employee owned so that all our staff had a little bit more security. They had direct involvement in the success of the business. From four owners, we went to now we have 13 active partners. We've divvied up the value of the business into equal shares of 1% or one share. And after you've worked here for a year, you're allowed to buy at the current market rate as many shares as you want. It's a very positive effect so far. Definitely changed my perspective about being here and working here and how much I invest in the day to day. I realize that this has become my family in a way. It's like we call it the Trident family. To be in this position where I feel like my voice matters is pretty awesome. I just like noticed that I want to learn more about like business and how it operates within the city, you know, especially during COVID. It's like, oh, suddenly I'm like interested in writing to the community council about things, you know. Yeah, I do feel more invested in that way. We have meetings every couple weeks and we actually just like bring ideas and hash them out and are able to really hear each other. Most employee-owned businesses run through co-ops or ESAPs, whereas we decided to take a direct approach where every owner has the direct singular vote. It allows us to have a wider diversity of opinions, a wider diversity of how we may approach the current situation and future situation. And it allows us to just be stronger because now we have a larger group of people that are directly involved in the success of this business. There's no chance for the Trident to be owned by people that are not directly involved in the community itself. I think that strengthens our relationship with our community, really solidifies us for succeeding into the future. I realized how much I want to keep this place the way it has been for the past 40 years, like what I believe it to be. I think in a way, like, these times are really ripe for different opportunities and taking different approaches to things because everyone's sort of making it up as they go along right now. I feel like I'm just kind of taking it as it comes and that it just feels like, you know, the right wave to be on, the right thing to be a part of, and I, I just want to continue to grow with this place. Good.